Hello friends, in this tutorial we're going to implement Shima on text view. So let's open a project or create one if you don't have a project in mind where you want to implement the Shima text view. So the first thing you want to do is add a linear. I've added a linear H. Then inside this linear I'll put a text view. Then let's just increase the size of the text view to somewhere like 60. Then we need to import the Shima library. Let's just head over to a git repo and get the library's dependency. So this is Shima layout. Though it's deprecated, you can still access a new one there. The usage is almost similar. So what we need is this implementation. Just copy this. Then import the library. Go to local library and choose D8, not DX. D8. So we'll compile this with uh, Java 8. So just paste that there and hit start. So this will download your library and you can enable it down there. Once it's enabled, go back. So we need to convert our linear two to a Shima view. So let's look at the documentation again. We're going to work with XML. So to convert it, we just copy the top part and convert it to a Shima layout. Convert from linear layout to Shima layout. Save. Then we also need to inject some properties from here. Let's see which ones do we need, do we need, do we need, uh, okay. We only need this one, the last one, which is the duration. So inject the duration. Save. What else do we need? Then you can also add an ID. This is not mandatory. You can still use the same ID, linear 2 or linear 1, whichever. But I want to go with the documentation step by step. So I make my ID Shima text. Then the last step is actually to start the Shima with our Java code. So just copy this Java code. Go in on create. Let's use add source directly there and paste our Java code there. And our ID is here, Shima text. If your ID is not Shima text, input your ID name there and save. So once we run this, we should be able to see our Shima text view. Install the project. Then we open it and boom. There we go. So you can see that our Shima is working. So you can customize this to suit your needs. For now, we end this tutorial.